The following is from NIT, National Instructional Television. These are symbols, pictures that can stand for one idea or many ideas. Man has always made symbols. Man, woman, conception, the body, body and soul, body, mind and soul, peer. A symbol can also be an object to frighten away evil spirits. Or to communicate with the gods. can be a symbol of many different things. Written language began with the symbols of early man. Why did symbols change with time and look less and less like real objects? The symbol for rain was first a picture of falling water, but it slowly changed to simpler form. Still, people thought that beauty was just as important as readability. Recording information by hand and passing it on was very slow. Dürer designed an alphabet that was still beautiful, but easier to read. and the alphabet continues to change.
with silk screen printing. The process is slow. details can be included with the etching process, but it is still slow. Modern technology speeds up communication. The computer not only passes on information at a tremendous speed, it can also store it in a small space. Can the computers also be used to create art forms? Computers can be used to control signs. Signs help people in a hurry. Mr. Two, two, wind two three zero degrees, variable one zero, altimeter three zero zero five. 
At highway speeds, your life may depend on reading signs. A city has many moods. At night, signs change.
How do artists use the shapes of letters and words? Or say that the end and the beginning were always there, before the beginning and after the end. And all is always now. Words strain, crack, and sometimes break under the burden, under the tension, slip, slide, perish, decay with imprecision, will not stay in place, will not stay still. Words move, music moves only in time. But that which is only living can only die. Words after speech reach into the silence. Only by the form, the pattern, can words or music reach the stillness. Is man still important? A new symbol? A new sign for our times? This Images and Things program was produced by the Kentucky Educational Television Network for NIT, National Instructional Television, in association with a consortium of 26 educational agencies.